one time we did like this heart thing. Like we had a, we were, it was like, it was like a heart on a paper and we had like white in there. Like what, what makes us happy and makes us have joy. And so I think it's really good because it is teaching them early how to deal with those big emotions that might have led to outbursts and now they know that I can do something to calm down. With respectful ways and again with our PBS framework, our office referrals have decreased and we also see within our community families and our community classrooms a little bit more caring, a little bit like this morning I was out greeting students when they were coming in. I see a kindergarten, a kindergarten student coming up the steps. I see a first grader. Now they really don't have very much interaction during the day. Kindergarten student turns around helps the first grader up the steps. Those are just little things that we see that are happening on a daily basis. Well, what if you're feeling um, down? What, what makes you happy? And they'll say, my dog or my mom. A lot of them say their mothers, you know, and, and so it just it melts your heart. You just think, oh, how sweet. I like that I do gymnastics with my friends and I love my family. And I like playing Roblox. I like going to bed with my cats. Um, I think this is a great program. Um, it helps with the social emotional learning. It's a great stepping stone. I think that the Respectful Race curriculum provides us with a lot of material. And when we print off those lessons, we can really, the teachers can go and, you know, do exactly what it says, but it's also helpful for us to be able to like, oh, okay, I might take it this route. Or, um, so it's very adaptable. We, um, we had sticks Miss Kilmer gave us and we had marshmallows. We had to um, work together to make a marshmallow tower.